hi friends in this video I am going to show you how to make full subtractor by using only two XOR gate two AND gates two inverter and one OR gate okay so uh, before starting this video you have to uh, you have you have to watch this video till end then it would be you will understand better okay so now first you have to click on this schematic capture then this window will appear as you can see and now you have to you have to pick your devices from this window from this window okay so here we have uh, two inverters required so inverter so here we have uh, here we have this one we have required two inverters simple digital so this one is inverter so now we are sorry we are right now here okay so now you have to select uh, AND gates and XOR gate so first you have to select AND gate so here we have simple this so you have to double click on on it then it would be selected right now here and XOR gate XOR so now XOR gate with two active inputs here we have selected and now we have a required one OR gate okay so now your OR gate is here so you have to double click on this then it would be selected okay so uh, now we have a required two logic states uh, for inputs and outputs so logic state okay so you have to select this and this logic pro okay and click on this okay now it's okay so uh, now we have uh, uh, we, uh, now we are making full subtractor how let's see so first uh, you can select this and you have to select this here and here we have a uh, two XOR gate required okay and two inverters one is here and the other one is here and two AND gates so one AND gate is right now here and one AND gate is right now here okay and uh, one OR gate required so this one OR gate is required okay so now we have a uh, two uh, so you already know about that so in full subtractor we have a uh, we have two input uh, two bits means uh, you have a uh, two inputs and one in bit okay so one in bit uh, so one body borrow and you can say so one is here and this one is here and this is this pin this one is your borrow in pin okay so first you have to end logic probe so this is your difference pin and this is your borrow out okay so you have to attach this with the wire and we have uh, here you can see this is your borrow out okay this one this one is your borrow out and so we have a uh, joining wires here here and this one I am deleting this one so we have delete this this one okay now this will be uh, this will attach this one will attach with this and this one this wire will come 
to this one and attach with this okay and your borrow in will come to this and the other pin this one the output of fux or gate would be the inputted to the second or gate x or gate okay and this pin would be connected with the second end gate and this will first you have to invert it this one and connect to to this one okay and then this uh, this the output of this one this and first on it would be to the input to the or gate okay and the output of second and gate would be the inputted to the second uh, uh, this or gate okay so now your simulation is completed here so here we have uh, this one a and b we have these these two are the inputs and this is your borrow in this is your borrow out and this is your difference difference bit okay so if you want to write here so you have to click on this and then you can write easily with the size so this is if you can say this is a a then this is now your a would be here now your b so this is your b here this is the second input and so here we have a borrow out so here we this one is a borrow out and right now here we have required difference pin so you can see here difference and this one is your borrow out so so sorry borrow in so borrow in will come here and borrow out will come here okay so you have to click on this then you will this is your borrow out this is your borrow in pin okay and this is your first input it come here and the second p would be come here so now your simulation is ready so you have to run this I am running this simulation right now let's see so now your simulation is right now running so if all inputs are zero then you can see your output is zero okay so if this one is one then you can see difference pin is one and borrow out is one you can also verify this with a, your with your throat table so then if the both are one then you can see borrow out one difference zero okay so this one is zero this one is one then both are zero if this is zero and this is one then you can see both borrow out and difference is zero and if this is zero and this is zero this one is one then you can see both are one okay so if uh, all are one then you can see your output is difference pin is one and your output is also one so hope you enjoy this video so if you have any question then ask me in the comment section okay th if you have uh, if you have uh, if you are like this video then it would be very good for you